Hello, welcome back to Hostify. My name is Alex, and today we're going to show you how to update the UXG Pro via SSH to a new firmware version. Sometimes you may need to upgrade the UXG Pro via SSH because there may be some incompatibility between versions on Unify Network, and it can't update the UXG Pro by itself. Uh, you might need to use the command line on the on the device to get it updated. There are a couple ways to do this. The first way is to SSH directly into the device, and the second way is to use the debug terminal within the Unify Network application. For this video, we're going to log directly into the UXG Pro via SSH using the terminal on a Mac OS machine. So the next thing to do is try and find the IP address for the UXG Pro. To do this, go to the Unify Network application, cross the devices, and then the IP address is listed just there. So my UXG Pro is 192.168.1.1. If you're on Windows, you can use PuTTY to SSH into devices. So in my case, I'm going to go to Terminal, and then we're going to go to SSH, and then my name, which is the username for the UXG Pro. If you're not too sure where the username is, it's under Settings in the Unified Network application. Go to System, Advanced, and then you scroll down, and then the device authentication details are in here. One weird thing with the UXG Pro is when you adopt it from brand new, the username is root, and then once you adopt it to the Unify application, the username gets changed to whatever is within Unify. So the password is there. I'm just going to copy the password to my clipboard and then go back to the terminal. So we're going to go to SSH Alex at 192.168.1.1. Password, we're going to paste that in. And then we're now logged into the UXG Pro. So go back to our guide briefly. And we'll see what commands we need to run. So upgrade commands are ubnt systool, firmware update, and then in this space here, the firmware URL we copied from the downloads page. So we're going to try that now. So ubnt sys tool, fw update, and then we're going to paste in the URL for the firmware version. And if we go to ui.com forward slash download, we'll be able to view what version of firmware is the latest version for the UXG Pro. So at the moment, the Unify Next Gen Gateway is up to date. My one is on 3.1.11. But for this example, we're actually going to downgrade to an older version. So if we go to past releases, and if we scroll down to Next Gen Gateway, it should be a bit, well, if we actually type in the device, so UXG Pro, we're actually going to downgrade to 3.1.8. So the download page for Ubiquiti has changed a little bit. So if you click on download, actually just download the firmware manually. And what we want is the actual URL for the file. So if we right click download and click on copy link, back to our terminal, I'm going to paste that in, press return, and the UXG Pro will go ahead and pick up that update from the internet and then it will reboot and update. Once that's finished, you'll see in Unify Network application that the device will go offline. It will then restart and then you'll be able to use the UXG as normal. So that's everything you need to know about updating the UXG Pro via SSH. If you want to find more information on how to do this, we've got a link in the description to this particular guide. If you want to learn more about Hostify, have a look at hostify.com. We do hosting for Unify, UISP, and TP Link Armada. You can contact our team at support at hostify.com. And you can contact our consulting team, Hostify Pro. Check out the website, hostify.com forward slash pro, and hire an engineer to help with your project today. Thank you for watching this video. My name is Alex, and we'll see you again next time.